Good morning students. Today we will do a exercise on shade and shadow in isometric views. So in previous class we have done shade and shadow in orthographic projection. So as we already discussed in the previous class, shade of any, of any object depends upon the source of light, shape of the object and the plane on which the shadow is falling. So we have learnt about the different angles uh, like altitude angle, azimuth angle and uh, now we will do the exercise how to draw shadow in isometric view. So you can see on your screen one is the front view, this is the top view of the object, this is the isometric view of the object and uh, this is the light source in elevation but if you see in the isometric view this is the elevation and uh, below the particularly below the elevation and the ground line there is a shadow vanishing point and we have done the nomenclature of the all the objects in orthographic projection also in uh, isometric views also so this is the ground line now i'll show you what to do to find the shadow of this object in isometric view with respect to this is the, our light source so let's begin so first of all we will convert this point A from the light source like this and convert the point E from the shadow vanishing point like this we will get one point this is the point 1 in the same way we will also converse the point B and F and then C and G and D and H. So I am going to converse in point V and from the light source and F from shadow vanishing point. So we will get the point 2. In the same way, we will converge these points. So by converging all the points C and G and D and H, we got the point 1, 2, 3 and 4. So this is our shadow profile. So we will join these points. So this, this is our shadow profile so we can make it dark with respect to this source. The source light source as you can see in the plan it is situated one unit away from this side and it is five unit height of the light source is the five unit. So this kind of shadow we will get. So we can shade it for the representation so you can see that we have 